live above the clouds in New South Wales, Australia, about an hour west of Sydney. I guess my favourite um, producers and people who inspire me. Um, uh, there's a long list here, but uh, yeah, here he goes. I got Pete Roth, we got the Rizza, um, you know, whole DRTC crew, Nas, Mob Deep, the whole Wu, in fact, um, and Ninth Wonder and Little Brother was big influence on my beats and uh, Mad Lib, JD, it's just too many, too many to think of. quite well here, particularly in Melbourne, it's a tune called Fair Dark Eyes. I suppose I first started producing in about 2000. You know, I was really just playing around with an MPC that I bought in Melbourne uh, that year. And, um, you know, it really stemmed from DJing and playing house parties and just loving, loving hip hop. And um, I basically just thought to myself, you know, I love all these joints, but um, yeah, maybe I can do this too. And like everyone else, um, you know, anyone who makes music just got inspired and just began to sample, you know, my dad's vinyl collection to start with. He had a lot of rock and a lot of psychedelic music. And, yeah, I mean, I made a lot of good stuff, but it was, a, it was definitely a steep, steep learning curve. Um, yeah, it was really difficult at first, you know, trying to find drums and you know just trying to build build the library and build the knowledge because not many people in my area were creating um, hip hop or electronic music that I knew of anyway. Here it is. All wrapped up and ready to go. That fiend he was hiding in my car, knocked me out and then I guess what inspires me to make music is anyone who, who has a love for, for what they do, uh, art-wise, uh, anyone who loves real hip-hop and um, strives to you know, keep the real hip-hop sound going while pushing boundaries. Um, yeah, also travel is a huge inspiration for me. And I find when I travel, I usually come back and I'll be, yeah, it'll, it'll get the creative juices flowing, I guess. I guess my beats are a, a bit different to what you might hear. You know, I try, I try not to roll with basic two bar loops, although you know my, some of my favourite tracks of all time are, are basic two bar loops. Um, I really try to, to you know, delve into uh, synth world and uh, also try and create you know, some organics in the, in the tracks I produce, um, whether that be from a sample or um, live instruments.
to be able to work with um, names such as Ono from Stone's Throw, M.E.D. from Stone's Throw also, and Prince Poe on the album. Um, I guess the internet, it shows the internet is a, is a beautiful thing uh, when it comes to worldwide collabs. And I was lucky enough that they, were, they, they liked the joints enough to, to want to be, be a part of it. Jace XL is a good friend of mine. He came from Brooklyn, New York. Um, I've only known him for a couple of years, but once I heard his voice, um, I just decided to get him on the track, and, and yeah, he blew me away. Unbelievable. The kid's a genius, and I hope there's many more collabos to come with him. Yeah.